Everything's for sale, my friend. Everything. Buy it a sister. On a guess, lend me your ears. Long has our Fevremon suffered without a true monarch to guide her and her people. Decades have passed since last His Majesty Erland sat atop the Draken throne. Long have we endured, yet it has not been for naught. At last, the bell has tolled on the age of the Consul. At last, we may celebrate the coming of our rightful ruler. The return of the Sovereign. <laughs> My word! Such an inspiring visage! Your Majesty shall have my eternal fealty. No Your Majesty, of oh, how long I have awaited this moment. Behold, before you sits the rightful inheritor of the Draken Throne, chosen by the dragon as its enemy. Behold and rejoice! Fortune has delivered us our savior at last! At last! Praise be, for only the Sovereign's guidance can lead us true. All hail the Sovereign! All hail! Let all present Pledge your allegiance to the Sovereign. Let us be united in the hope that our legions reign will near end. Long live the Sovereign of Vermont! Long live the Sovereign! Arisen, thou who wouldst slay the dragon, if thou seekest to behold this world in its true aspect, abandon thy reason. Cast aside thine heart and thy life, both. I ask thee to demonstrate thy will, for naught but thine ambition can alter the course of the rivers of fate. Now, which one of you was it? No need to be shy. I've just got to take down a record of your name and face. Come on, step forward. Aha! I thought I recognized you. I ill like that look in your eyes. Tis queerly brazen for a pawn. Most of your kind have eyes blank as a cadaver's. Mayhap tis only natural, seeing as how you rise from the dead. There's aught different about you, though. Could it be that you fear death just as we mortals do? Worry not, Vessel. Three days here, and you'll be longing for death's sweet embrace. Come along, you feckless dullards!
Learn your place, Paul. Speak to me another time. I'm on duty. Do your injuries pain you? Pray, do not overexert yourself. This is no place for one of your ilk. Tis harsh beyond measure. Even we pawns are pushed to the brink. You ought not anger the overseer. Let us proceed to the site. Time for you to get to work. You are prepared to work. Then you all begin by carrying stones out from the station in the back and bringing them here. is quite cluttered. Pray leap over all that postman. A mug of ale is just behind. A job well done. Now the next step is to What is this commotion? Perhaps we ought to investigate.
boulders, barrels, and the like can make effective weapons for the clever combatant. I would recommend clinging to your friend. No one could survive a fall from this height. Not even a pawn. Don't just stand there! Shoot it down!
Great! Keep your distance, Arisen! Worry not for me. The brine may swallow me whole, but I will not perish. There is a stone not far from here, known as a rift stone. Pray, seek it out. If you're truly the Arisen, then our paths will surely cross again. Oi! Are you alright? What happened here? A griffin appears one moment and falls the next. And now you stand before me. Was it you then? The one who was riding on its back? It is a wonder you survived. Accompany me to the stronghold. We'll treat your wounds and hear your story. Exactly is this jail you say you escaped from anyway? I've never heard of such a place. There's certainly naught like that here in Vermont. Could it be you were held in the neighboring country of Batar? Nay, seems that's unlikely. We've been estranged from Batal ever since the war. It is difficult to imagine any citizen of Vermont being sent there. Fine! Goblins! Let's take up your weapon, sir! You'll be needing it! Where are you going? I'll not force you to deceive trees, but Ida, if you find your strength left, try the curative or have a bit of green touch. When one of the fiends comes, best guard or dodge, else you'll be sore on the morrow. Make use of the slope. It will give you an advantage against their ranks. There are oft items to be scavenged from the bodies of monsters and their ilk. If you're not squeamish about picking at their bones, that is. Have you beheld the dragon as it is? I've not, and I count that a blessing. All I know for sure is that it is a beast ere more fierce than a griffin. Oh. One need only look at the miserable state of the village of hell to see that. Where are you going? I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. Welcome, Arisen. We pawns have long awaited your arrival. What is this? The pawns. They bend the knee to you so readily, but then... No. Surely you cannot be the Arisen. You seek the Riftstone, do you not? We can take you to it. Pray. Come this way. Before you stands a rift stone. Tis a gate by which we of the Pawn Legion may cross o'er into this world. Pray, summon your pawn. Simply paint with your mind's eye 
the loyal attendant whom you would have serve you.